Taking that thing in low, arms next to the leg, just so, yeah. Very good, Steve. Awesome, dude. That's my best ball all that day. Sweet. That's the secret sauce. And you don't know how, how good that makes me feel. I mean, you know, I'm out there and it's like, hey man, quit giving me the boots. Fuck, you know? What's the boots? It's <laughs> <laughs> you know? Let me show you what Bryson, I'm gonna show you what Bryson looks like. You better stand right back here. Good <clears throat> Wow, let's put some shit in this one. All right. Hit it super hard. Now the wind took that, still went to the left. Okay. It did? Never doubt me when we're on camera. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Oops. Probably can't hit much better than that. Uh, we certainly don't need to. For now. When I'm back here, yeah. I'm starting to feel the confidence of getting the hammer down. Going, yes. after, going after it, going right? Going after yeah. it. Yeah. Well, shit. You know, not crazy, you know. Yeah, yeah. No, I got you. Well, I mean, you want to feel like you can turn on the afterburners a little bit, right? right? You know, uh, so the club face has to be closed to whatever direction you're swinging. Okay, and the ball will curve right to left for us right-handers, draw. So it's like, okay, what about if I, I want to start it out to the right and draw it back in, or start it straight and just draw it down the left center or edge of the fairway? Uh, no problem. So we start with the club face closed a little bit. Well, how much is, you know, what do we do? Well, I don't know, maybe, maybe 20 degrees or 45 looking as you're looking down, right? Okay, and just make sure the face is this way when you set up. And then it's like I'm a cat. I'm like a catcher's mitt right here when you're taking that backswing, right? Drag it low and in. There you go. No chance. That's gonna slice. That's pipe down the middle. Balance finish. Oh man. Doesn't seem like it's hard to me watching you do it. Remember, arms got to be loose and taking it in low and dragging and wind it up. Can't do it enough. Right. That's a run. Yep. You can hear the difference on the club, right? Oh, yeah. And feel it. I tried to stay loose on that. That's the, when I, I mentioned that like a swing or two ago. I didn't know if that would take effect. <laughs> I didn't know, if, you know. Remember, loose arm, you know. We're only as good as our last thought. So if you start thinking about margaritas and burritos going to Celia's, that's not so bad. Huh? Looked just a little slow. I mean, it just look looked a little too cruiser mode instead of like getting it, getting a little something going. Ball position up a little bit more. Yeah, you got it. Inside low, 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 whippy, fire. It. See what I mean? Yeah. I think you need to have that chutzpah, that kind of action on the backswing, you know, to to rip it in this way. You know what I mean? That's where it lit. Maybe it's not so much, you know, go slow and that way, but it's more like, man, I gotta be. Well, you, you have to realize I've had nothing to this point that gave me that confidence. Oh, yeah, yeah, well. Yeah. You know, yeah. because a bigger turn or wider this, yeah, yeah, yeah. it just, it, I always thought I'm coming over the top, I'm yeah. coming over the top. Yeah. This, I could honestly tell you today that um, I feel, you know, if I could, when I come out Sunday, and uh, and it works, and that's that'll be huge. Yeah, and, and it's kind of cool is that the more you could say, the more I do it, the more the more degrees I do it, the better it gets. Yeah. So you, you can't do enough of it. And the more you can't you, go in that way enough, low in it, you can't do it enough. You can't overdo that. You can't freaking overdo it.
You can't have that close enough and take it in there enough. You cannot do enough of that. You can't take it close enough and take it towards my Puma bag. Very solid on the face, so you gotta just make sure. We're gonna go again, okay, can't do it enough. Club face, yep. And when it goes there, it's gonna just be, you can't do this enough, right? You just can't take it in and keep the face to the ground, okay? Enough. It's gonna go right by your right leg, low and in. See that's, see the ball drawing though? Yeah, even though it didn't climb up like the other, the curb, yeah. and that's the deal. What's the what's the move? Inside. Okay, where are the arms going to be relative to the right leg? Right on them. Right on them. Right. Yep. Legs are turning. Yep. Right next to them. Right, like you're burning the hole in those pants there. Yeah. Normal club face. Normal grip. Normal. Normal club face. Normal grip. Yeah, yeah. Okay, you got it? Yeah. Okay, now close the face. Turn the face like we're doing, right. Okay, so there's a mistake right there. And what I mean by that is, let me have it from you, and you can stand just, I don't, it doesn't matter where. Yeah. So what you're doing is this, is, is you've got your normal grip on, which looks nice, and then I say adjust the club face, and all you do is rotate your hands. Yes. Okay, that's not how you close, that's not it. It's this, it's like, here's my grip, and I want the club face closed, I turn and then put the grip on. You follow me? Yeah. If I just go like this, that's not really closing. All you did was move your hands that's and what arms. That's I've been doing the yeah. whole time. Okay. I just caught that when I was kind of watching closely of how you did it. There we go. Salad. Very nice. Thank, huh? you. Thank you very much. You yeah, so you, yeah, yeah. So you got to get in here and just twist this thing first and then put your normal grip on. Okay. And then if you, uh, and then, yeah, I mean, you're good to go. And if you don't like that look, you can just roll your arms back to where they normally are instead of going like this. You don't, yeah. you know. Did some nice walking. Yeah, you did. Hey, everybody, what's happening? It's Gormanator here. I just want to let you know that I'm doing live Zoom lessons. The next best thing to an in person lesson, a live Zoom. So, you want to kick that slice to the curb, hop in, and let's get going. I've got my launch monitor and the tools I need. If you're at the office, work, wherever, we can get it done. Click the link down below, hit the page. It'll tell you all about the lesson and how it works. You'll be excited to get it done because I'll take care of you. See you guys on the next video.